Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel Planning for Reality and welcome to a bonus video for this week. I hope you're all doing well and I hope you had an awesome week and your weekend is going great. Um, over here I am feeling so much better um, and um, things are starting to feel right again. Um, there are going to be ups and downs in life and I know that and um, that's for everyone and everyone has a different situation or different circumstance I guess. Um, I tried to make some positive changes um, this week so some of the things that are not related to, to finances but could be an idea as well in you know saving money and things like that. I don't ha have many people around me anymore, like family or friends, because um, unfortunately, a lot of people took sides when it came to uh, my relationship with my ex-partner, and a lot of people took his side um, because they thought that my reasons for, um, you know, wanting to to take a break or end the relationship um were community based um because they thought I don't like them or whatever but that wasn't the reason it was just um they misunderstood or misinterpreted the reason and they took side uh, a different side than mine and and that's okay by me I would rather have people that are genuine around us than um you know not so genuine but at the same time, what's happened is my kids were um, so used to having people around. Um, their dad was very social and was part of a big community, or he still is. And um, people would come around, come around to our place, or you know, we'd be invited to hang out with them, or whatever it is, community events and, and whatnot. And all of a sudden, it went away. And so the kids, it affected the kids. Um, so what I did was I um, <laughs> I posted a, um, like an ad, but not, not on like a social media. It's like a, um, one of those apps for students with their parents and the teachers and things like that. So I made a post on there to, to say that, we're going to this park um, on the week and, and we would love to make a group that where we could all hang out, you know, mums and, and their kids. The kids can play together and we can bring each bring a snack and so that the kids could have, you know, something to, to go to because they're not currently enrolled in any sports or activities uh, because they just couldn't afford it, whereas in the past when they, they used to go to a private school and they used to attend all of these extracurricular activities because I was working and we could afford it or my income was more so that was a very positive um, step that we took and the reason why I'm mentioning it is because it is a financial well it's a financial tip or a saving money tip. You don't need to spend crazy amounts of money for your kids to be active. Um, we used to pay a lot of money for like soccer and basketball training and different things like that for the, the kids um, and gymnastics and swimming lessons. And th they were all in different um, seasons. However, we still needed to pay for them. Uh, where this way they can still take a ball, run around. We took snacks, um, you know, took a few snacks and each parent took a few snacks and fruit. And it, there wasn't many of us. It was only three three of us together, three parents. Um, but the kids had a blast. They got some sport in. They did, you know, one-on-one -on -one games or two-on-one. -on -one, I don't know. They made up their games. And um, we didn't even have to pay that much money. It was just a few snacks and I think it was like about $10. I got it all in my grocery uh, shopping anyway. So that was a positive. The next positive is the day that I filmed the video, I was um, explaining what had happened. I was devastated and just not sure what to do with myself. I got a package in the mail and I don't usually 
you know, get things like if I'm not if I haven't ordered it um, and expect it I I've never just received anything randomly and this was just a random package and I thought I opened it up and I was so happy as like this made my day the company that I had been getting the purple binders from sent me a red one I, I told them if they had other colors to please please keep me in mind and send it to me and if you know we like the color we can order some for the Etsy store and I love 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 this red now too and I'm really hoping that they're gonna come out with a blue maybe and a yellow I don't know I'm really really hoping maybe green um, next but yeah these ones are so high quality these binders I've never had a binder like this um, in my whole journey the feeling the texture that they feel high quality and sturdy so they sent me the red one and I wanted today change over um, some envelopes from the purple binder into the red one here on video on camera so what I decided to do was keep the purple one for these high priority bills I hope you can see yeah so keep the and I had this dashboard in between which I'll just keep for now and then I'm going to take out everything car related and I'm going to make the red one my car binder. And I think I will probably add more categories in here later on because, for example, there's one here I missed, which was Microsoft Office subscription. So, you know, that could be one. And then maybe later down the track, there'll be like insurance or whatever it is. Um, but yeah, I'm going to keep this for high priority and I'm making the red one my car. And what I did was I made dashboards to match the red. So all I have to do in my binder, in my envelopes, I should say, is take out the dashboard and replace it with a new one. So let me go ahead and find the one for car registration since that's, that one is on top. And I made a little note to myself here showing what... I had taken out from here and what for because I took the car to service and I took it to change some tires and get a wheel alignment that was recommended by the mechanic and there is also one more thing the mechanic needs to do um, before he can deem it as a trustworthy car a reliable car and then he said that whatever is um, comes up later it will be from my wear and tear so it's going to be mechanically sound until you know they're not made to last forever okay so hopefully by then we will be good so i took out this money and i cleaned off the tracker um i don't know if i want to put car registration on top i might yes i'll do that and how much do we have in here it's because it's new it doesn't bend open very well but once it fills up it will be very nice 152 is in there now so that's 37 37 icons that i can color in um i might pause and come back Okay, so I've colored in 37 icons. It's due in January 2020, 2025, which is great. And I'm not planning to take any more money out of car registration, so I don't fall behind on car registration. The mechanic actually told me that I did make a good purchase so that the car wasn't too expensive. I got it for a good price. And he said that, you know, all cars are going to have problems eventually. So... Um, if something does get wrecked, it's not because I purchased it that way. Um, so I will still save for a new car regardless. This is for car tyres. Um, but let's get this one fixed. I took everyone's recommendation. And we took 300 out and got some new tyres on this car. And now there's $20 left. So where is the tracker for new tires? So that means there's four. All right, pause. There's just four. And we shall build this one back up slowly because 
Now that we do have the tires, we don't need them quickly so we can add smaller amounts in. Then we have car service or car maintenance. I took out 50. And that's why I love these clear envelopes and this, um, you know, you add the dashboard or the insert because you can just change it out whenever you want to change your binder or change the theme. It's not a big deal. So this one has 10.25. The car service was 300. So I need to say 300 for the next service. This is separate from a new car. Did I say 25 or 35? 25. So that's one row. So work, finishing this trucker would be good for one standard service. Any extra parts would be more. And that's where car emergency, we would be saving in car emergency for those extras. Or keep going with the trucker. Um, then we have new car. I took out $50 for the car service and $50 for the wheel alignment. I tried to separate the uh, the amounts just so that I don't I didn't want to empty every single envelope or one particular envelope. So now it's got 20, 30, 40, and 50 still in there. I took out a hundred total, and this one we will be saving for our future car. Whenever that may be, we are going to focus on what we have, not on what we don't have. Um, and then we can think about a new car as well at the back of our mind, or maybe in the middle of our mind, because it might have to be sooner than later, sooner than we would like. That's okay. Car emergency should be the next one. And that one has 15 in it. So we can do 15. Um, one, two, three. I'm so loving this red binder. I'm so happy they sent it to me. And I quickly replied and told them to send me some so that I could um, post them on my Etsy for whoever is interested. So as, long, as soon as I have those, I will I will go ahead and um, and post them up. So this one here, I didn't change the tracker, so that one still has the full amount in it. 20, 40, 55. Fuel buffer. Also, we kept it as is. Maybe this one should be first. And then car battery and fine. These two, I need envelopes for them. Bear with me while I just grab some envelopes. Okay, it seems that I don't have any made up, but that's okay. Fines, I'm separating fines from license and license renewal. Um, I'll be separating fines and I'll be adding car battery because the car makes a funky sound when it starts. The mechanic checked it. He said, no, it's not a big deal and the battery is currently fine and so is the starter and everything um but there is a part that we need to order so once it comes in and we change that that sound could go but i need to keep money for a car battery for the future so i want to save that so i need two more envelopes and this will be my i'll put this at the front so i remember remember that i need to add those categories in and we can now take these off because we know that we paid 400 for wheels and wheel alignment and 300 for service so far. And if 
say this new part uh, with the mechanics fee is five to six hundred dollars if we can cover it from here or um, I will just won't make my debt repayment this week because I've been trying to pay off that electricity I am almost done guys I'm so excited I'm almost done with it because that was my um, priority for September to get rid of the electricity bill so I might if I don't have extra money I might use it what I'm trying to say is I might use the money that I was going to use to pay off the electricity to fix that part or I might come in here and take it it just depends on the time how I'm feeling what I'm thinking what's coming up um, things change daily so yeah I am so 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 excited for this thank you so much for joining me to the end and you will see this binder in my weekly cash stuffing videos because this is also a high priority um, along with the purple one I enjoyed changing over um, my binder with you and I hope you enjoyed it and I hope to see you all in my next video thank you so much take care and I will see you all next time bye 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 for now